All right, so what we're going to do is we're going to set up in a behind the back deadlift, holding that bottom of the deadlift position, and then do an arm raise to the back. This is very similar to a front lever pull. This is going to be a little bit more dynamic with a lighter weight, and you can get more range of motion. Yep. You can actually do the same movement with a kettlebell. You'll have to widen your stance a little bit, and the only thing is you can't get quite as much range of motion because your thighs are in the way. You can also transition from the top position of a row back to that lever position, and this is an awesome drill for developing strength for the deadlift as an accessory movement, as well as upper back and using the lats. Unlike the previous barbell version, this one's done heavier and we're not looking for as much range of motion. The angle between the arm and the torso much more closely resembles an actual front lever here. Doing the movement with dumbbells probably allows you the greatest degree of freedom. You can be full range of motion and a little bit more dynamic. It also lets you get that nice row to front lever position which even though it looks like a tricep kickback, it's not. It's much more similar to an ice cream maker.